Hi everyone, uh, my name is Will and I'm going to be starting a new YouTube series. So in the past I've done music tips um, and I was fairly okay with that. I got some people interested and I got some lessons out of that which has been a really good thing for me. Um, what I'm going to be starting now is we're actually going to be starting working on something called ear training. So ear training is uh, basically listening to music interpreting what you've heard and reproducing it. Um, the reason why I've been inspired to go ahead and start doing ear training videos um, as like a kind of shorter mini series type thing on my channel is because a lot of the people I'm in in blah, 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 excuse me a lot of the people I am encountering lately are having a lot of hard times with ear training hearing melodies and replicating them either on the piano on an instrument singing whatever it may be we're having a very hard time actually distinguishing um, specific sounds specific rhythms and things like that so for today's introductory video we're gonna do the easiest part of ear training. The easiest part of ear training, believe it or not, is actually going to be pitch matching. Pitch matching is where you hear a note, you interpret the note in your head, and you sing the note. So, let us begin. The very first note, la, you try it. Okay, so here's a couple things we can do. One, I'm going to sing the note again for a long time. What I want you to do is try to use your ear to get your pitch to match my pitch. If your pitch is above it, you need to uh, relax your diaphragm and drop your jaw a little bit more, and it should bring the pitch down. If your pitch is below it, you need to drop your jaw, but you also need to tighten your diaphragm to push the pitch up. Okay, so here is the long note. Let's see if you can work with that to try to match the pitch. Here we go. La. Were you able to match the pitch? Another great thing to do is to go ahead and find your favorite song and try to sing the chorus with it. The verses can be kind of tricky because they change depending on which verse. A lot of songs, a lot of the verses um, don't match at all. So <clears throat> using the chorus, the thing that you hear the most, is a really good way to work on your ear to get those matched pitches. All right, well, next week we'll be talking about more. Um, again, I hope you work on that ear training and that you're able to pick out music a little bit better. Um, if you have any questions, leave them in the comment section. Make sure to like and subscribe and share with a friend, and I will see you next time. Again, this is ear training.